Hello, we are discussing about gate 1997 EC paper. This question is related to the push and pop instruction. It is match the following question. The right answer for this one is 1 C and 2 B. Push instruction post increments, uh, push instruction pre decrements the stack pointer whereas pop instruction post increments the stack pointer. We will see. So now let us assume we are first starting with push. Push instruction is either push B or push D or push H or push PSW. These are the four different ways of push instruction we have. Push B that means you are pushing the contents of BC register pair onto the stock or the contents of register pair DE are pushed into stock or register pair HL contents are pushed into stack or program status word PSW means program status word program status word is a 16 bit register out of that one upper 8 bits are accumulator and lower 8 bits are flag register so whenever you are writing push PSW accumulator and flag register contents are pushed onto stack so let us assume stack pointer is at stack pointer is at 0 f f f hexadecimal whenever you are executing a push instruction the first step it do is stack pointer is the present stack pointer contents are decremented by 1 ok now so that the present contents will be equal to 0 f f e and second step is the now you are pushing either push B, push D, push H you are using. So higher order con higher order register or higher order register, higher order register contents, higher order register contents are pushed on to stack pointer. Next again, stack pointer is decremented by 1. Okay, stack pointer is decremented by 1 by that time the present stack pointer will become 0 ffd and now lower order register contents lower order register contents are copied into stack pointer present location this is what happens so we will go with this example first assume that this is a stack pointer and it is starting at memory location as 0 fff so it doesn't use the contents data from this memory location so the data is unknown whenever you are using push instruction first the stack pointer is decremented so it will become 0 FFE and it will copy the higher order contents of higher order register contents so if you are using push B it will copy B register if you are going with push DE it will copy DE if you are pushing going for the H then it is otherwise it will be copying accumulator for push PSW accumulator contents are copied into this stack pointer location again the stack pointer is decremented by 1 so it will become 0 FFD lower order contents are now copied that means C or E or L or flag register ok now the present contents of stack pointer is 0 FFD now we will discuss about pop ok that means whenever you are going for the push so first step is it is decrementing stack pointer then only it is copying the contents so pre decrements the stack pointer before copying the register contents onto stack ok pre decrement stack pointer before pushing the contents before pushing the contents onto stack that is important now we are going to discuss about pop pop is also in the same way pop b or pop d pop h or pop psw again psw means it is 16 bit register where the upper higher 8 bits are accumulator lower 8 bits are flag register pop b pop d pop h pop psw this instruction copies data from the top of the stack and loaded into the 16 bit register specified in the instruction ok so if you are writing pop b 
register pair BC are loaded with top of the stack contents. So now we assume that one the stack pointer contents are 0 FFD present stack pointer contents 0 FFD hexadecimal. If you are executing the pop instruction, what are the operations takes place? First one the contents of stack pointer are copied into lower order register lower order register okay and then second step is stack pointer is incremented by one then present contents of stack pointer are moved on to higher order register higher order register next one is stack pointer is again incremented by one these are the steps taking place ok so first it is copying the data into a lower order register then it is incrementing the stack pointer that is it is called as post increment so for pop instruction what we are saying is post incrementing the stack pointer ok after copying after copying the contents after popping the contents Okay. So the right answer for this question is 1C and 2B and remember one important point here the contents of while executing push instruction even though you are pushing the contents of either BC or DE or HL or PSW the contents of those registers are not modified simply you are copying the contents from these source registers into stack and the contents of source registers are not modified and push and pop instructions both are single byte instructions ok no flags are going to be modified both are single byte instructions push and pop and no flags are going to be affected that means whatever the flag conditions before push instruction the flag is maintaining the same condition is maintained for all flags even after executing the push or pop instruction one more important thing is push is a one byte instruction okay and the number of machine cycles number of t states required for push is it is a one byte instruction three machine cycles it requires and number of t states it requires is 12 whereas pop instruction if you see it is a one byte instruction it requires three machine cycles and t states required is only 10 because pushing is going to be taking push instruction whenever it is pushing ok uh, first fetch instruction consisting of fetch with 60 states it uses it uses fetch instruction uh, that is fetching the data it requires 60 states for the push whereas fetch operation it requires only 40 states that is the difference so push instruction takes more number of t states than pop instruction this question is asked in gate 2016 this year okay. so this is one more important point push is taking 60 states then pop instruction because push uh, instruction is pre decrementing the stack pointer for that purpose it is going with 60 states it is not only uh, uh, it is decrementing first that is the reason it is given in the textbook thank you